Hey, hey, sure, you may be asking why am I up here? We'll take a look around. This is downtown Hamilton, the YMCA right there. I am on the upper level of one of the city's parking garages, and this level is growing in popularity, not because people want to park up here, but because they want to play. The city has turned this level into a park known as Park 5. People come here to play, ride skateboards, walk dogs, and sightsee. Located above green space on the upper level of Hamilton's McDoolin parking garage is Park 5. We like to come up here, skateboard, uh, roller skate, ride bikes. A lot of people still don't know uh, about Park 5 up here. But it's been growing in popularity, especially as people look for alternative, safe ways to enjoy their families. It's a great space. There's a group that gathers on Sundays. They skateboard and bike and watch the sunset. And you have the view of the old courthouse, Markham Park, High Street Bridge, and some of the city's sculptures. This is in the Dora district, so people get drinks all the time and bring it up here with their food and, and just have a good time. Just like other open spaces throughout the city, like this alley, Park 5 will soon have tables and chairs so families can sit. Down the road at the Fitton Center. Here we are going into fall and our beautiful theater uh, is still closed. Ian McKenzie thoroughly had to reinvent how people enjoy the arts. We've had to reimagine, rethink, uh, and reconfigure for 2020. How'd he do it? He brought productions outdoors using Pyramid Hill, parking lots, and lawns. And then we have a partnership coming up uh, in October called Reels on Wheels, and it's mobile outdoor cinema. Creativity in the age of the coronavirus. City leaders say it's what's attracting people to Hamilton and keeping businesses open. And one thing we realized today, this is also a great spot to come and watch the leaves changing colors. And also, as they mentioned in my story, the sunset, if it was a little later, we'd be able to see the sunset. And take a look, they're drinking Dora cups. One fact about this Dora cup, we've talked about how it's been so successful here in Hamilton. Well, city leaders say businesses and bars and restaurants have sold four times the number of drinks in Dora cups this year than previous years. Reporting live in Hamilton, Karen Johnson, WLWT News 5. Uh -huh.